I come from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I've been playing the cello seriously for a couple years, but I've been playing since third grade, just for fun. But it grew into something that I loved, and now I'm here at Brevard, and I'm training for my auditions, which is actually really exciting. I'm Madeleine Dosimo, and this is my story. My first day was really scary because I came in and I didn't come in with anyone I knew and I was afraid that no one would like me and that I was going to be that weird kid that everyone was going, ha ha, loser, oh, you're such a loser, you play the cello, really? But then I realized that everyone here plays an instrument and so it's not loserish. So whenever my RA was showing me to my cabin for the first time, it was up a large rocky hill and I did not pack accordingly to suffice to the large rocky hill and so my RA was helping me carry my luggage up and it was so funny because I kept tipping over and we actually bonded in the time the amount of time the large amount of time that it took to get my luggage up the hill and it was really good because it was kind of it's been an ongoing joke um, well my teachers um, over the course of the six weeks have been David Primo and Yumi Kendall and they're both amazing cellists and I don't know if I would have gotten to work with them had I not come to this camp. We worked a lot on how to look at a piece of music so I came in with a piece of music, a box suite. For an entire week I was focused on the box suite and I was like what more can I do, what more can I do, what more can I do and for the second week I came back I had already sounded so much better. Um, well, we just had our first concert and I was kind of nervous, but it turned out okay. And the first song was a little shaky. And the second song was really fun because it was a piano concerto. And the third song was Brahms 1. And it was such an amazing thing to play. It was awesome. And we sounded really good. And it was so exciting. It's very, very easy to focus on practicing here because there's nothing distracting you from practicing. You're here to practice. You're here to get better at your instrument. So on Sundays, usually my friends and I will go hiking out to the National Forest and it's absolutely beautiful. Like, I never swam next to a waterfall before. <laughs> And I just did a couple days ago. It was awesome. And there's so much stuff you can do here. Overall, it's been so much fun because everyone is living here together. And so everyone kind of, you get to know people a lot more over the course of the six weeks. Like the first week, everyone was kind of friendly with each other. And you're like, oh, hey, how are you? Yeah, I think you play the French horn. I forget. And over the course of the six weeks, it's just, you grow to be such good friends with everyone. It's amazing. I really love being able to bond with people, not only in music, but also in other things. Like, some people like the outdoors, some people like reading, some people like different books, some people like different foods. And you get to bond with people not only in music, but also by other interests that we have. And it makes, like, lifelong friendships. And, um, Hopefully I'll be able to see all of my friends soon. I'm Madeline Dosimo and this is my story.